All right, here's a two minute tip for checking that something is dead straight. So we use a string line, everyone uses a string line because it's the best thing to do, it's, you pull it nice and tight and it's straight. But if you have it tight on the side of the piece you're trying to check is straight and there's a little bump or undulation in it, that's gonna throw it out. So what we do is we, we get our fixing in at either end, pull our string line nice and tight and then we get a block, any size block, but as long as they're all the same to start with. So we stuck, this is 18 mil, slide that in there. We've got one in at the other end. And then we've got these 18 mil blocks. We can go along the length of it and check that we're nice and straight. So there you go, look, that's slightly out there. So not we can- Not to worry about. Not on a, not on a roof. Okay. We're not building a piano, as Dan says. So we have got, we actually looked down this, we, th we knew there was a slight bump in the middle. Yeah. Because this this piece of took the timber has actually got a little bump in it. A little bit there. there. Yeah. So we've got a slight bump from around about here up to that wind post. We can tap that around a little bit if we need to. But I mean we're talking one or two millimetres on a roof. So, so it depends what job you're doing. You just work out what tolerances you need. Yeah. Uh, bonus tip, two for the price of one. There we go, so tying it off, uh, a nice, quick, easy way to tie it off on one screw. So we get it tight, make a loop, twist it round, 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 five or six times, and then hook it over the screw. Yeah. We pull it tight, which I'm putting the light, yeah. that's it, put it right, like that, yeah. then pull that one back to there, that's let it. it go. There we go. That's it. I can put that that's down. It. Nice. And that's as tight as what is that? A middle sieve, would you say? Hang on. D flat. Is it? D flat, yeah. Okay. <laughs>